Hey friends, what's up? Moses here at the Driver Success Channel. So just want to share with you something real quick. Um, during my time off, I, uh, we had to take our car to the mechanic because it needed some repairs. And so I used Uber to move, uh, to, to go to the mechanic and also to go, uh, to go pick up my car from the mechanic. Um, and the guy who, who took me to pick up the car, the Uber guy, was uh, we got into talking and came to realize that he was he had been a truck driver so i asked him why he was no longer driving trucks and he said it was because he could no longer qualify uh for his physicals whenever he, uh, like when he got to do his physicals he couldn't qualify and you'd be amazed how many um, people get out of trucking just because of um uh, their physicals, uh, their health condition, uh, they can't drive uh, trucks anymore. And the thing is, my physicals are expiring this month, uh, which means that I needed to do a recertification for them to be a current uh, come next month. So last week I went to, um, uh, to do my physicals and everything was fine. I passed, but... One thing that I didn't like about my physicals is that I realized I had I had gained a lot of weight. It's amazing how some of these things can creep on you just little by little, and you know you just lack a little bit, and before you know it, uh, something that may not have been a problem or something that was small turns into a big problem. So I just wanted to make this video to just uh, encourage you to. To, to be mindful of some of these things that can can just start out as minor things and yet become big things. Uh, for me, I'm a small guy, uh, meaning I'm a short guy, which means that my ideal weight uh, based on the BMI index chart, my ideal weight is supposed to be between 146 and 150. That's the range I should be in. And normally I usually try to keep it under 155. I try not to go above 155. Uh, 146, 147, uh, kind of, I don't know why it, it feels so, sometimes I feel like I'm so small. So I usually want to keep it a little, uh, uh, really I try to keep it uh, somewhere in, in, let me say, between 140 and 150, I mean, 148 and 152 that's where i try to be but guess uh, what uh, my weight was 164 164 that is overweight for me for my size 164 which means i really need to lose about uh, 10 to 15 pounds and uh, that's something that i'm gonna be embarking on to make sure that i take off that weight uh, somehow I, I slacked down, I wasn't really uh, exercising as much as I need to. And also I know, I know for sure the things um, that really caused me to, get, to gain weight. One thing that uh, I've told you guys, I love drinking tea. I don't know how many cups of tea I drink. Um, and this cup here, this is usually the size of a uh, cup that I have. Um, I don't know how many ounces this is. I think it's about maybe 16 or 20 ounces. And in this cup, I put in, you know, those small sugar sockets? I usually put in around 8 or even 10. So I drink a lot of sugar. 
and I have these cups maybe like I can have like maybe four or five a day are drinking these. Um, so that you, you, when you think about it, if I was to have like four and maybe I use 10, that is 40 circuits of sugar that's a lot of sugar so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna cut down maybe instead of having 10 in a cup i maybe put like four or five or even less in my cup the other thing i know that i like uh, eating a lot of rice uh, it's one of um, uh, my favorite meals uh, so I, I need to cut down at, at least reduce maybe the portion sizes uh, the other thing is I like bread and uh, baked stuff like bread. Um, my wife makes good uh, stuff like meat pies and um, she makes like apple pies and sometimes I do, I, uh, we do bake cakes and cookies, all that stuff. So I need to cut down on, the, on that stuff. Now, I'm not the guy who just goes on a diet and says, no eating that. I'm someone who wants to do stuff in moderation, which means that I just cut down while I increase my exercise and, you know, like look for that balance because I know how to, uh, how to put myself in balance. It's just that I slacked, but I need to get back in, in shape and, and get my weight in order because right now I'm about 10 to 15 uh, pound, um, pounds overweight so I need to get that um, back into check um, I'm 164 the last time I measured at uh, the fiscal so I need to bring that back down to uh, the low 50 or 150s uh, probably 150 or even a little under 150 that will work for me so I'm going to be embarking on that journey uh, if you guys out there are in the same situation where you've slacked in exercising and eating healthy, I encourage you to get back. I just don't, um, just don't slack in some of these areas because, as I said, uh, many people um, leave tracking not because they want to, but just because uh, maybe because of their health. This guy now drives Uber, but he was like he was saying he used to make good money but now he's driving Uber, but he got out just because uh, he couldn't pass his physical. So uh, you guys should all um, make sure that we keep in, um, in shape, uh, uh, visit your doctors to know what's wrong with you. Uh, whatever needs to be worked on, don't slack, just work on it. And so uh, I'm going to be uh, doing my best to work out and uh, reduce my sugar and carbohydrate intake. Um, really check out my um, uh, my health status and make sure that I get back in shape so as I record this today is March the 27th um, so March the 27th 164 pounds uh, I will have to check in uh, maybe after maybe a month or so uh, usually they say it takes about 90 60 to 90 days to see some change so uh, maybe if I remember, you guys, you can remind me if I need to, to remember to check in at 60 to 90 days and see how I'm doing with that. But I just wanted to share with you that uh, that I'm about 10 to 15 pounds overweight. I need to work on that and also to encourage uh, any of you that is that may be in the same situation uh, to just encourage you to do something about it. Uh, we all can do something about our situations for the better all right guys let me head on until next time stay blessed and stay safe bye bye